Today, we will talk about how to become an ultrasound technician. Let's have a look at the details. Ultrasound technicians use ultrasound technology to examine the health of organs as well as developing fetuses in the womb. They play a crucial role in aiding doctors with the diagnosis and treatment of medical problems and help to ensure the health of the mother and fetus during pregnancy. To become an ultrasound technician, it's necessary to study human anatomy and receive training in using ultrasound technology. If you want to know more about how to become an ultrasound technician, keep watching. The first step is meeting the educational requirements. Get a high school diploma. You'll need a high school diploma or GED in order to enroll in the educational programs that prepare you to become an ultrasound technician. As part of your prep for a career as an ultrasound technician, study math, English, computer science, health, and both the physical and life sciences as part of your high school curriculum. Complete an accredited ultrasound technician program. Find a program accredited by the Commission on Accreditation of Allied Health Education Programs, COHEP, and get your associate's degree or complete a postgraduate certificate program. If you're shifting careers in the healthcare industry, or you're a high school graduate, you can take a one-year program. These fast-track programs generally reward you with a vocational certificate. Two-year programs are the most popular, and when you complete the two years, one to one and a half years if you have taken many of the prerequisite courses, you will earn an associate's degree. You can also take a four-year program and graduate with a bachelor's degree. Stay away from eight-week or six-month programs. Not only do they not prepare you adequately for a career as an ultrasound technician, but it will hardly matter as you will not be competitive in the job market. Note that some colleges may require you to complete a certified nursing associate CNA, course before being accepted into a diagnostic medical sonographer DMS, program. If you already have a bachelor's degree or associate's degree and want to become an ultrasound technician, the diploma program may be the best option. Each program has different requirements, and the previously earned degrees may or may not have to be in a related field like radiologic technology, nuclear medicine, or an allied health discipline. Diploma programs offer you the opportunity to expand your career options by adding diagnostic medical sonography to your expertise. The previous degree earned and the program requirements will determine how long it takes to complete the program, but it usually takes 12 to 18 months. You may need to complete prerequisite courses depending on your previously earned degree. Always choose a COHEP accredited diploma program. Earning a master's degree in diagnostic medical sonography can open up many new career options. If you are interested in moving into administration, teaching, research, publishing, or a position in private industry, this is the degree to pursue. You must have a bachelor's degree to apply to a master's degree program. The program is designed to be completed in 12 to 15 months. You may have to take additional courses that are not part of the master's degree program's core curriculum, which adds to the time it takes to complete the program. Always attend a COHEP accredited program. Clinical training may have to be completed. Get clinical training. While you're enrolled in a program, you'll have opportunities to take internships that provide hands-on clinical experience. You'll learn ultrasound skills in a healthcare setting and have the opportunity to put what you've learned into practice. You can receive additional training at professional conferences and continuing education opportunities. Work on gathering enough hours to take the American Registry for Diagnostic Medical Sonography ARDMS, exams. The second step is getting certified and finding a job. Take the American Registry for Diagnostic Medical Sonography ARDMS, exams. These are not required for ultrasound technicians, but you will greatly increase your marketability and in turn, your paycheck. By successfully completing these exams and becoming a certified ultrasound technician or registered diagnostic medical sonographer RDMS. The exams include two parts, a general physics section and a subspecialty of your choice, OBGYN, abdominal, etc. Take as many exams as you want to get extra certifications that will let you specialize in certain fields. Apply for jobs. You've gone through the training, taken the tests, and now you're officially a registered diagnostic medical sonographer. Look for job openings at hospitals, doctor's offices, and health clinics in your area. Now, the question is, how much does an ultrasound technician make? 
Most ultrasound technicians working in the United States will make about $78,000 a year, after having a couple of years of experience in the field. When just starting out in this career, it's typical that the salary for an ultrasound technician is closer to $55,000 a year. However, once you have several years of experience, certifications, and even specializations, this career can garner over $100,000 a year in salary in some places. Those who work in large populations or in areas with higher socioeconomic statuses will likely make more than people working in small towns or rural areas. How much does it cost to become an ultrasound technician? Most people who are interested in working as an ultrasound technician will earn an associate's degree. On average, an associate's degree from a community college can cost around $15,000 to $20,000. Those who go to a university may pay a little more, depending on where they enroll. Bachelor's degrees can cost upwards of $35,000. Also, certifications can cost anywhere from $100 to $300 per certification. All in all, it can cost anywhere from $16,000 to over $40,000 to become an ultrasound technician. How long does it take to become an ultrasound technician? Employers prefer an associate's degree in this career. However, it's not completely necessary. Ultrasound technicians who enroll in an associate's degree program should expect it to take about two years to finish. There are other degrees online and at community colleges that can take anywhere from one year to 18 months to complete. Earning a bachelor's degree can take around four years. Depending on the program you enter and the type of degree you'd like to receive, it can take anywhere from one year to four years to become an ultrasound technician. Why can't ultrasound techs tell you the result of an ultrasound? If you've ever had an ultrasound, you've probably wondered why the tech operating the machine won't tell you anything about what they're seeing. Your ultrasound tech should not tell you about your results, or even react to what they see since this might influence the patient's decisions about treatment. That is not to say that your tech has no idea what she's looking at. An ultrasound tech should know their anatomy well enough to perform the procedure, but they are not doctors. Only a doctor is qualified to share test results with the patient since they can also discuss treatment. There are some tips and warnings for you. 3D ultrasound technology is currently the vanguard, and 3D ultrasound skills are increasingly in demand. Get skilled in the use of 3D ultrasounds to get an edge in the job market. Finish high school and graduate. This should be a given, but it bears repeating, the more educated you are, the further you will progress in life. Finishing high school is the first step to having a satisfying career. The US Bureau of Labor Statistics paints a rosy picture for the future of ultrasound technicians. The market is expected to increase 19% from its current level of 59,000 jobs, from now through 2021. There are many pseudo-schools or schools of questionable character that advertise a degree for ultrasound technicians. It is not uncommon for these schools to shut down or go bankrupt before the end of your training or to hand you a degree that you later find out is worthless. Be sure to go to an accredited school for ultrasound technicians and get an associate's degree. Many positions require you to be certified. After you graduate, make certification your highest priority. Thanks for watching our video. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel.